This is the quickest, no messing around way to level your glass bed on your 3D printer. So stick around. First, you have to make sure all the feet on your printer are firmly in contact with the table. Otherwise your printer is going to rock around on you. And we need the program that we're going to use and you need to set your first layer to around 0.2 millimeters. A little bit thicker seems to work a little bit better. Turn on this skirt and set it to print with as many lines as you like. I'm going to go with two in this case. I'm going to set the distance to about 20 millimeters or three quarters of an inch away from the outer edge of the glass. That's to avoid any clips that you might have. Now if you need a little bit more time, you can adjust the speed of the skirt to whatever suits you. Butter up that build plate with your favorite adhesive. In this case, I'm going to be using glue stick. And this is an important step because it does help the first little bit of extrusion to bond when it might not normally. If you're already a little bit too close, make sure to bring that bed down a little bit so the nozzle doesn't rub on the glass. We can go ahead and load that print. Just make sure that we know which way to turn the knobs in advance, otherwise this is going to get messed up. I like this method because it always gives me a chance to re-level the bed if I need to just before the part begins to print. And you can get really close just by eye. This bed level method also adjusts for nozzle size and layer thickness and because I'm constantly changing nozzles this does help me quite a bit. The only two colors that might give you some trouble are black and clear but with the right lighting it's still doable. If you want to have the brim and nothing else, just open the code, scroll down to the section for the part, and delete that and save. Now make sure that you delete the last extrusion step, otherwise you're going to have a large amount of extrusion at the very end of the print. And you can save these by nozzle size, you can use them anytime you need. So struggle no more, if you can get that first layer right, you'll have more success overall and maybe you'll be able to delay buying that BL Touch for a little while. Thanks again to all my patrons for the support and if you enjoy this content, consider showing the channel some love by subscribing. Hit that notification bell for a heads up on future videos as well. Take care everybody, we'll see you on the next one.